Hey, welcome back to another episode of Funny Google Reviews, eh? I'm gonna take a look at it. We're gonna look at the, the Leaning Tower of Pizza. We're gonna take a look at it, see what the reviews are. I sound like I'm from New York. This doesn't work. I'm trying my best, all right? Anyway, we're gonna be looking at the funniest Google reviews for the Leaning Tower of Pizza. So let's just go right ahead. I tried to look Italian. This is the most Italian shirt I have. I guess I could have worn an apron. Jonathan says, can someone just tilt it back to normal, please? I like how he's like personally bothered that it's not tilted correctly. He's like, can someone just fix it? It bothers me. This guy says, my plane crashed into it. That is what made it lean. I just spit everywhere. So your plane crashed into it. That's what made it lean. Okay, cool. Awesome. Next review. Bruno says, worst experience of my life. An insult to the Statue of Liberty. I don't know what the Statue of Liberty has to do with this. And then he posted a picture of his really ugly cat. So, thanks. This guy says, the worst, so bad, I have nothing to say. Yeah, you don't want to like elaborate at all on what's going on? Why, why you had a bad experience? No, just one star and you're good. All right. This guy says, Japanese men spit in my food. One star. Uh, to be honest, that's a risk you take no matter where you go. You know, there always might just be a Japanese guy. It doesn't have to be Japanese. I mean, it could be anybody. I'm not saying, like, it's not like Japanese people have a tendency to do that or anything. But like anywhere you go, somebody could spit in your food. What am I talking about? Peyton says, My Arden chicken have slugs, it no tasty. Orange chicken? They serve orange chicken at the Leaning Tower of Pisa? I don't believe that for a second. I don't think it had slugs in it either. I think you're a liar, Peyton. The actual name of this place is the Leaning Tower of Pisa, not the Leaning Tower of Pisa. And if you're wondering why it's leaning, the answer is because of the scientist Galileo. He went up with two iron balls to do some experiment about patterns of objects falling, but Galileo was too heavy for the tower, and that is the reason why he's leaning. Now, back to location from history. Quite short, because this tower is only 58 meters high, blah blah blah. Mm, people who are scared of heights should go there, because it's so short. <laughs> a very good review, but he, le he left one star. So a very informative review, but he only left one star. And also, this was left by Osama Bin Laden. So I I'm not really sure how to feel about this review. Tom says, this thing sucks. It's tilted. This person says, la tour est penchée, dommage, which means, the tower is leaning. What a shame. Why do people care so much if the tower is, like, that's the whole point. Why are you going to a place called the Leaning Tower of Pisa and then complaining that it's leaning? This guy says, nul, la tour n'est même pas droite, which means, it sucks, the tower is not even straight. Again, what, why? Why do you care if it's straight? People are like, people just wake up in the morning and they're like, the Leaning Tower of Pisa is not angled correctly. <clears throat> So about that, I had to teach Tony a lesson. Duncan says, not my first leaning tower, and definitely not my last. I don't know of any other leaning towers, so it probably will be your last. Also, you left one one star. <laughs> Amy says, this is the most like whiny, rich, like English person complaint you can ever leave. It was wet and cold. Oh, I could barely move my fingers. I want to go get some warm pizza, but it was freaking horrible and cold. I recommend never going to Italy on a rainy or cold day. The town of Pisa is also trashy and vandalism everywhere. People were coming up to me and shoving little keychains in the tower in my face and coming up to me with cheap plastic selfie sticks that cost three times more than they were worth. That accent went through like 14 different countries by the time I got to the end. It's like the most whiny bitchy complaint you could possibly leave. One star, by the way. <laughs> People were coming up to me and give, putting keychains in my face. Oh my god. Grow up. Tia says, Not much there apart from the tower. Great to look at, but no need to spend much time there. One star. Why would you go to the Leaning Tower of Pisa and then say, Not much to look at, except for the tower that I went to see. One star. Th Thamer says, the height of the tower is 55.86 meters from the ground on the low side and 55.6 meters on the high side. The width of the walls is the base is 200 meters on this. Like this guy clearly just copy pasted from Wikipedia. I don't see the point. You can even see the little, like the reference marks. He just straight copy pasted. Get a life. Isaac says, horrible. There was no pizza at all. So disappointed. Would not recommend it. Sub to Icky Jader on YouTube. Okay, well. Okay, well, Minecraft videos, awesome. He has 17 subscribers, I'll just... Oh, well, I'm already subscribed. Dakota says, wasn't the Leaning Tower of Pizza. Disappointed. I haven't ate anything in days and have no way of getting back home. Someone please help. 
Landon says, everything was terrible. The tower shook and scared me. This tower just shakes on its own sometimes. That's kind of scary considering it's like, <laughs> like a year away from tumbling over. Jam says, tower is leaning. Okay, whatever, boring. Yeah, I mean, I guess people 800 years ago didn't have much to do other than look at leaning towers. I guess by today's standard, maybe it is a bit boring. Cade says, why don't they fix it? It looks so stupid. It literally ruins the grounds. Everything is all perfect and landscaped. Then you've got that idiot thing falling over in the middle of it all. He's again, another person who's really angry that the building is not totally straight. Like that isn't the whole freaking point of the building. I like how he also called the building an idiot. You got everything's all nice around the area. Then you have that one idiot in the corner who can't stand straight. This guy says, fake, one star. Fake, like it doesn't exist. Fake, like it's not a real building. I don't know, whatever. Karina says, I'll believe it when I see it. One star. <laughs> Again, you people think that it's fake? Is that what? Okay. Dan says, I visited the Tower of Pizza and I was immediately not impressed. The structure itself is crooked. Okay. And no one seems to care. That's the point. Our guide, Prosciutto, said... Your guide's name was Prosciutto? Said that it was built like that on purpose. Italians are notorious for selling you crappy products like fake hats and fake leather bags. I just didn't know they were in the fake crappy tower business too. They took 200 years to build a structurally unsound building and call it a masterpiece. Typically Italian. Also, the name of the building is completely misleading, as there was no pizza on site anywhere. They could have just blamed the problems on the Mexican legal workforce they obviously used for this instead of taking pride in such failure. P.S. Don't go to Giuseppe's Sausage and Foot Massage. Very unsanitary. <sighs> Can we finish this video now? Sausage and Foot Massage. Like they massage your feet and sausages? Or you get sausages and... Anyway. This guy says, It was the worst vacation ever. Me and my family went for a week and the hotels were gross and the tower was on the downside of our visit because there were so many tourists. There were too many tourists at the tower, that's what made it suck. Yeah. That this is coming from the guy who went for a week and stayed in a hotel with his family. You have any idea what a local would call you? A turista. You're just a hypocrite. This guy says, I live in California. I tried to use my GPS to get to a pizza shop. My GPS said I needed to take three flights, 17 bus rides, and a day of walking. Total days, five. There was no pizza. Now I just live here. I'm so hungry I could eat the Leaning Tower of Pizza. Same. Yeah. Uh, me too, buddy. It will soon be no more. Falling down. Can't stop it. Coming very soon. That's really ominous. I don't like this. Can we get the FBI to look at this guy? Because this sounds like a threat. Coming very soon to a theater near you. Sat Pal says, very beautiful. One star. Okay, well that's all the reviews I have for the Laning Tower of Pizza. Pizza. Thanks for watching, and uh, see you around. Hey, welcome back to another. This is one of you like a Boston accent. Hey, no, it's not. Hey, that's that's freaking. That's like New York. I make it a bit Mario. Grazie, grazie. Come and make you a pizza. I make you a pasta.